Hey YouTube, I'm out here at the range today and I'm gonna be shooting the Glock 19. Hey YouTube, how you doing? Uh, it's Kurt with Gentleman Arms here today to talk to you about the Glock 19. Is this the perfect pistol? Is it the best or are there better options now? For a long time, it was absolutely the best. Is there better carry options? Maybe. I mean, this, if you look at it from from this angle, it's a little bit wide. In a real size hand, you know, it it fits pretty good. I mean, honestly, I could I could handle a little bit bigger. That's what she said. Bigger grip, but it is. It's a fine firearm. The best thing about the Glock 19 is it goes bang every time. You don't have to worry about it. My bad. Here she is. So, it's clear. No magazine in there. Maybe one more time. See what we get. We'll get down at the bottom of the trigger. Five pounds. I don't know. For all you guys that crap on Glock trigger, I've just consistently got about five and a half pound pull. Reset. Right there. Boom. Are there better triggers? Get a single action. On a 1911, hardly comparable. Carry option. I know there's no manual manual safety on a Glock, which is, you know, for a new shooter is kind of weird. You know, you want to be able to disengage, but there is a safety. It's just not a manual one. It's not, you know, thumb activated safety. Is a is a firearm of this size? able to be carried and concealed? Well, short answer is absolutely. Can't see, it's gone. It's right there. I know that everybody wants a micro compact and that gun is small, it's very concealable and will absolutely save your life. But is it the best option to shoot? And are you going to be accurate and effective with that firearm? This is this is the best size. This is my opinion. Now, are there other guns that are as good? I need to take this thing apart and clean it. Put about 1,500 rounds through this thing without cleaning. Trying to get it to malfunction. And it eventually did. I don't know. The Glock just uh, had a malfunction there. I don't know what that's about. Old ammo, maybe? You get some coffee on you or something? <sighs> Fucking coffee pie. Yeah, coffee pie. <laughs> <laughs> We're empty. Just so you can see in there. Now, this is a Springfield Armory Hellcat. And a much smaller, smaller size firearm. Certainly 
when you look at them in, in this comparison. And let's see. And right next to each other. You can see how much larger the 19 is. But not really. It's really not. The place where it's larger is obviously in barrel length. It's slightly wider. You know. But here, this is where it changes, is this grip. Well, if you can see, you know, how much larger the 19 is versus a Hellcat or a P365, you know, or Glock 43X. This is my wife's carry gun. And it's nice. It's a nice little gun. It's not bad. It shoots pretty, you know, pretty consistent. We did have, it came with an optic on top, a red dot. The Hex, uh, Hex Wasp, I believe is what was on there. And I'm not crapping on red dots. And I'm just not sold on them being part of a concealed carry firearm. The whole point of this thing is to be as small as you can make it and still be able to shoot. And these sights, really, if I could get it in the camera here, I'm not good at this part, but if you can see that night sight and then you, that U, they are really nice sights. Now, we'll do a little comparison <laughs> with the Glock, regular old Glock sights. Oh, grip angle, very similar. They have a you know, they have a very, very similar grip angle. To be able to use this firearm effectively, I mean, the Glock 19, I believe, is the perfect size pistol. It has excellent recoil control. It goes bang every time. It has nothing... I mean, look how simple the inside of that thing is there's nothing to it if your clothing allows you to carry a bigger firearm and and conceal it that is your best option this is a great size firearm for concealing it is not fun to shoot it's snappy it will save your life this little bad boy can hold uh, 15 plus one, the one magazine came originally with a 11 plus one and a 13 plus one. And we've gotten, you know, I got Natalie a 15 plus one or 15 round magazine for her, uh, for stocking stuffer. If you like watching these videos, then please click that like button, subscribe to our channel and share with your friends. Thanks for watching. On the Hellcat here. Mm. Right around six and a quarter pounds. Six. Six and a quarter, six and a half pounds. Yeah, right around there. Hey, YouTube. We're out here at the range, we're uh, going to be shooting the Glock 19. It's kind of seeing if it is the best pistol. going to be shooting the Glock 19. The sun's in right in my eyes. It's hurting me. But I'm doing this for you guys. We're trying to determine whether the Glock 19 is the best pistol or not. But, I mean, everybody already knows that. So. Glock 19. All right. Got the, uh, got the Glock 19 here. And yeah, that's a regular Glock mag. I'm gonna shoot that one. This is a Magpul. Gonna try it out, see if it works. I don't know how well they work. But it's for a Glock 17, so it's a little bit big. Not a 30 rounder. All right, and let's see. Nope, I don't have any earplugs. All right, I got my eye protection on. So, again, we're trying out this uh, cheap Magpul 
all polymer uh, Glock mag. I mean, Glock makes a good magazine, so, but these are really cheap. All right, here we go. All right, I think I got the target set back up. I took out the target again. I gotta get some chains. I keep putting it up with rope. If I could hit the middle of it, I guess I'd be in it. In, in all right shape, but. All right, cycled all the, all around. So that's cool. I'm gonna go set up my target again. You can feel for this little guy right here. That tells you. Now, now you know it's loaded. You can feel that little, little bump. Anyways. Walking back from the range into the house. And... I don't know, Glock 19. Obviously, there's going to be those Glock haters out there. I don't know. Will they not like it because it works? Shoots every time. If you like watching these videos, then please click that like button, subscribe to our channel, and share with your friends. Thanks for watching. I'm walking out here to the range. Let's see. The backwards man, the backwards man. I'm not really good at this, sorry.